the playoffs continue here tonight. It's the semifinals. It's the Trinity Western Spartans hosting the Thompson Rivers Wolfpack. And one from Purdy. Mealy with the left side attack, and that is dug up well by Ludwig. Can the Spartans capitalize, though? There's a pass to the setter, and Avery Heppel, the second-team all-star, couldn't finish this one. It's the Wolfpack who pick up the point. Their bench jumping up and down, subbing in. Jump serve. Once again, Gamash, and here's Avery Heppel with the middle attack. And before this match, you would have saw the introductions for the Canada West first-team all-stars and second-team all-stars. Avery Heppel recognized the middle. First ball by Sitch. Now Kamladi going over to Hillary Howe. So Howe coming over to the left side here, and that was the right answer. Spartans coach Ryan Hofer able to drop something that breaks uh, this momentum for the Wolfpack. Yeah, just a small adjustment that he made there, bringing Hillary over, and just Trinity just has to be that much better to be able to use that block right now. McKaylin Sitch on top of the ball. Use the block or beat the block. That's going to be done with speed. Just Savin Chuck. And Pottle is blocked. The Spartans now with a 6-5 to five lead. Hotel rooms. At least the bus ride isn't too far for the Wolf Pack. And Ansa O'Doom scoring the first point after the break in the action. So makes it tough, taking out the center. Finch cross court. Finch looking impressive from the left side. Put that in the perfect spot. It was not a good contact at all. Kamladi over to Odoom, hitting from the left side. And there we go. We questioned her early on hitting from the left side, but Odoom makes no mistake about that. Serve receive setting up deep, giving some respect to Howe. And Howe able to drop this one in for an ace, getting the better of Finch. Gamash plays this shallow. Kamladi going over to Howe. Cross court drops it in. Ludwig was nearby, but Howe found the open court. Middle attack by Heppel, and she gets on top of that one. We were talking about Savinchuk just a few moments ago, showing off her height. And Heppel, listed at six foot four, gets on top of it. And Trinity Western back out in front. Back set over to Savinchuk, goes to Purdy. Heinen on the move to Sitch, and that look fluid. Sitch picks up the kill, and the Spartans within one point of taking us to that technical. Sitch finding her way around the block there. Kamladi. Oh, doom! She has had some great swings tonight. Just judging by the Spartans bench, they recognize the night that she's having Jada Harder. Really celebrating over there on this side, but credit to Odoom. Nice Pottle in, in that position has been doing a great job working the ball off the block. Coming out of the right side is McKaylin Sitch. So we've seen the Spartans middles early on in this set, hitting out of the right side. This ball played where it was possibly going out of bounds. Sitch is blocked in a one-on-one. -on -one. Kochit says no way. Yeah, Kochit's such a good blocker one-on-one. -on -one. You can see there, Sitch is. Odoom to serve. Left side attack by Savinchuk. It is over. The Wolfpack have defeated the number one team in the country on the opening night of this Canada West semifinal between the Spartans and the Wolfpack. 15-8 the final.